This is Shelby. Yes. And yes. <laughs> That's my name. And, oh my gosh. I love this. <laughs> I already love this video. So we're gonna be doing the cheesy friend tag today, which was created by Ingrid. Which is this is literally like the She's perfect so tag. Oh yeah, this is like the perfect tag for us to do because we, we love cheese. cheese. We are cheese people. Yeah. I'm only friends with you for the cheese. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> On Instagram, if you follow me, you might have seen this picture that you took when we were like way back, like in March or something like that. That I took? And yeah, you took, and we were at the hotel, and I oh. I was like, I was like this, and I was like, and like the With caption the cheese. Like, busted. And we were literally just having cheese for dinner that one night. We <laughs> yeah. love cheese. We just ate cheese for dinner. <laughs> yeah, cheese and crackers. It was in the hotel room. Not healthy. Number one is how and when did you guys meet? <laughs> so, uh -huh. you can answer that one. We met in PE freshman year with this terrible PE teacher that I'm not going to name, but she was not nice and... She was mean, guys. She was mean. She was, she was really mean. She wouldn't like her either. We became friends because we didn't like her, which sounds <laughs> terrible, but she was so mean. She made me do a humiliating thing in front of the whole PE class. It was so mean. Thank God we had her as a teacher, otherwise we would not be friends. I wouldn't have lasted very long in there without her. Stuff like that. Really she was... Weird. She was a mean person. <laughs> she was mean. Okay, number two is describe each other in three words. That's so hard. When okay, I got one. Bubbly. Bubbly. Oh. Um, happy. Like optimistic. That's a better word. Um, because that's kind of smart on the word. bright side of things. Oh. And I guess, like, creative. She makes insanely good jewelry. Sorry, oh, the lighting is really bad, but it's making us like look like we have really dark circles because we have light coming up, so we kind of kind of look dark. Gorgeous. Oh, all of you would no, <laughs> no. Okay, that's obvious. Um, oh my god. Humble. Um, okay. Life things like you're very good at getting the big picture on things. Like, this thing that I'm freaking out about is not even a problem. So like. It, it, I guess you bring they just me have up. like a good perspective or something. Yeah, she has a one. She's a insightful. Okay, so what were the three? Insightful, humble, and gorgeous. Thank you. That's so. Nice. What's your favorite cheese? This is for number three. We brought it for you. This is our favorite cheese. You can get it at your local Trader Joe's. It's so good, you guys. This is what it looks like. Blueberry cheese. It's this blueberry goat cheese, and it is so delicious. It's so good. I think it's because we like fruit, too. It's so soft. It's, it's, it's kind of, like, sweet, but goat cheese is kind of tart. Yeah. So it's a really good blend. It's, like, almost candy, kind of. <laughs> it's delicious. It's really good. Look, over there. Number four, if you could go anywhere in the world together, where would it be and why? <laughs> We've already kind of been there, I think. Oh, yeah. Orange County and Glen Ivy and Glen Ivy. like that. I want to live there. Glen Ivy. Glen Ivy is a spa in Corona, California, and it is so beautiful there. I think if we went out of the country, it would no. be fun to go to Africa. I, I thought about Africa. Africa. See all the animals. Like and, the elephants. And all the people there. Yeah, it'd be really cool. Yeah, Africa. Uh, number five, what's your favorite time of day to eat cheese? Dinner. Dinner. For dinner. Like cheese and then dinner, or dinner and then cheese. We have cheese for, for dinner. dinner. Who takes longer to get ready in the morning? That one. This one. What is your favorite recipe which includes cheese? Cheese and crackers. We just eat the cheese. You just like the cheese plain. You can't alter it. You have to let it be itself. Mac and cheese. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Mac, mac, and, mac cheese. and cheese. If you have not, why do I keep... Sorry, my hair just like keeps going towards my neck. If you haven't seen my healthy mac and cheese video, I'll link it at the end of this video and in the description box because, oh man, it is so good. It is low carb, low fat, and delicious. Yeah. Number eight. Do you guys have anything matching? <laughs> I want to show the audience. <laughs> Intergalactic pants. I feel like I'm in outer space when I wear these. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We have we have matching ones. It's pretty yeah. fantastic. We have lots of other matching things. Our houses our houses matching match. Like headbands and 
and matching. houses. We have similar. Dude, our house. We have like our parents have the same interior. And our items. refrigerators all have the same food. food yeah. <laughs> and our pantries <laughs> have the same protein food bars from the same place, all the time. And our moms like decorated our houses the same. Yeah. Like our rooms are like the same style. Mine's just different color. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty awesome. Number nine. What is their favorite song? Okay. Oh, we just do favorite artists because we like a lot of songs. Yeah. We like too many songs, so yeah, let's just do artists. Artists. Uh, okay, so Two Door Cinema Club. Mm-hmm. Oh, you just... It's you hard. Like, you I like a like lot of music. odd bands. A lot like, of people that, that... That no one knows about. Right, <laughs> yeah. No, it's they're cool. I'm a dancer. Yes. I'm required to learn those kind of things. She likes Phil Wickham, Matt Kearney, Tyler Ward. Ha! <laughs> I love Tyler Ward. <laughs> yeah. You guys should check out his music. Mm -hmm. Link in the description. Number 10. What is your favorite animal and do they like cheese? Uh, the animal. Does the animal like cheese? Right? Mm-hmm. Um, your favorite animal is elephants. I and like them. They probably like cheese. They look like they eat lots of cheese. <laughs> My favorite animal is an is a lamb. She loves lambs. And look at that lamb back there. Exhibit A. I don't know if they like I don't know, because cheese is dairy. They kinda of make cheese. Lamb cheese. I don't know. Would they eat their own cheese? <laughs> <laughs> That's like asking a bird to eat eggs. <laughs> oh. Number eleven. What's your friend's favorite T V show? I don't really watch TV. I don't either. I watch TV. We YouTube. like SNL. YouTube, anything YouTube. Yeah, pretty much YouTube is our TV. Mm -hmm. Okay, number 12. What is something weird you eat together other than cheese? Okay, that list is way too long to go into, so we like really weird. We like, seriously, like, kind of probably gross food to probably some of you guys, but we like really weird food. Like, like so weird, it's, it's kind of weird how weird it is. Today I made something weird. Yeah. It was pineapple, like a slice of pineapple, and I put some ham on it, and then some cottage cheese, and just ate it like that. Bam. And it was the best thing I've Bam. ever had. It was like being at a luau in my mouth. That's when we really have sleepovers, weird. like, we don't really eat, like, ice cream and no, stuff. No, we don't. She, we eat hummus. That's our junk food. <laughs> we eat hummus and almonds. We're like, like craving, like in the middle of the night, like, yeah, give me the hummus. I don't even eat like Cheetos. Number 13, if you could only eat one cheese for the rest of your life, what would it be? That was already answered in this. Blueberry cheese. Blueberry goat cheese from Trader Joe's. Yeah. All day, every day. And the cheese. And what? I really want to eat that right now. Is it blueberry cheese, man? Oh my gosh. <laughs> question Ingrid came up with was what's it like to be friends with somebody who lives so far away and since we live really close to each other um, I am actually doing like a charter school this year so it's kind of like homeschooling but it's not technically homeschooling because I go to a teacher once a week and I also go to a math class we're gonna change this question to what's it like to be um, friends with somebody who doesn't is like homeschooled school. or like doesn't go to school with you yeah so you can answer that one. Um, cause I went to high school with her. That's how we met. That's why it's hard now. Cause you like went before, right, with me. But I mean, it's good. It's bad because I miss her all the time. Like the time that we do see each other. Cause like when you go to school with someone, you see them every day. You're right. used to it. When when you do spend time with someone you don't go to school with, it's like, it's, it's special. You yeah. Know? Like this. Like, yeah. two friend tag special. Mm -hmm. It's like, you have to do, like, everything. Because you don't yeah. see them that much. So you're, like, so excited to see them all the time. Whenever you Shelby do see them. Shelby party! Yeah, that's it. That was the cheesy friend tag. The end. The end. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you want to see Shelby in any other videos, then let us know. We're going to go right. eat this we cheese have to now. So. Hang up now because we have to eat cheese. Yeah, so we're just going to leave with this cheese. Sign <laughs> Bye. Okay, bye guys. Bye. bye.